collapsing the punitive contingencies and not bringing in anything else, we're failing to teach quick, easy reading, the kind that would make, make it reinforcing to read something. And we are not also making uh, subject matters important enough to people that care about uh, learning something new about, about things. I think this can be done. I, I've had a hand in developing a, a reading series where you use uh, immediate contrived reinforcers for evaluation of sentences or just words and so on, so that uh, there is a fascination. The uh, kids like this. They, they work with it. They're always discovering that they have read something correctly, and in, the, in, the, in doing so, they, they do learn to read, and, and fluently enough, I believe, so that eventually they can begin to read for pleasure. But to begin with, you can't read for pleasure. Run, spot, run, that's not pleasure, <laughs> pleasurable. And it's absurd to expect that you can design primers in reading which are going to be naturally interesting to a child compared with television or something of that kind. But you can build in contrived contingencies that will get the child through the early stages of reading to the point of the kind of fluency